Sail in Sunday. Our next guest made a name for himself as an original member of the much-loved children's group High Five. Well, now Nathan Foley is back with a brand new album. Take a listen. You gotta strut, strut yourself for me. Well, in a little dip, feel a jiggle in a lid, yourself be free. And we are delighted to say that Nathan has strutted into the studio to tell us <laughs> all about Morning. it. Nice to see you, mate. You're yeah, looking great well. Great to see you too. Thank you. Hurricane been a while. debut solo record. Tell us about your vision behind this. Oh, you know what? I, well, it all started about two years ago, but obviously due to COVID, yeah. um, everything was put on hold. So I scrapped about 90% of the album and rewrote it. So uh, finally, after two years and, and you know the big lockdown, we finally be able to get the album out there and obviously my leading single, Strut. So I'm just super happy. You know, I'm very happy yeah. with so it. So you should be. You started recording this, as you said, in 2019 in New Zealand, yes. right? Did that help with the inspiration behind it? Because it's a pretty magical place, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, I love New Zealand. My management yeah. company's in, in New Zealand as well and, uh, and my record label, uh, Antipodes Records. So being over there was fantastic. But um, the other thing too was that I didn't really follow any trends with this album. I went with uh, the experiences and, and the songs that I grew up with, you know, that, those cool songs that had strong melodies and, and a live band behind it and yeah. uh, something you can rock out to, but also uh, something that's got a bit of inspirational uh, background to it as well. Who are some of the musicians or bands that inspire your music? Uh, well, Finally, for this album, there was In Excess, Stevie Wonder, Richard Marks. Oh. Uh, yeah, all the fantastic artists and singers. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's... And obviously, a, a lot of the songs on the album too were all about mental health. You know, because a lot of people have gone through a lot of troubles in the last couple of years. So I wanted to write songs to help people just get out of bed in the morning, mm. you know, to pursue their dreams and passions and get out there and, and live their life. You've been writing and uh, recording and, well, composing original music for many years. I mean, people are going to say, it's the high five guy, you know. <laughs> yeah. so, so tell us how your style's evolved from the way we first met and fell in love with you. You know, I'd, I'd there never... There he is. Oh, there I am. <laughs> He's that guy. A, a few less wrinkles, but, you know, it happens with age. Um, well, I started writing when I was 10 years of age. Um, High Five came along and, obviously, I'd never apologise. It was an amazing experience Why would you? Myself. Yeah. Um, obviously, strut is very different to High Five. Yeah. So I guess it just comes with life lessons, you know. Um, growing up a lot, songs that I wrote 10 years ago or even 20 years ago are totally different to what I write today. And, um, and they will keep evolving, I guess. But I wanted to write something diverse that everybody could listen to and um, everybody can adapt to. Well, your audience has grown up with you too, don't yeah. forget that. Yeah, absolutely. Well, they're not five anymore. <laughs> <laughs> uh -uh. Um, how do you feel when you see the footage of yourself on High Five? What a fun time in your life. Oh, you know what? I've always struggled watching myself <laughs> yeah. on TV. I get I'm it. like, oh, I can't watch that one right now. I but, get it. Yeah, so I, I love being on stage. I always have, but I never, ever watch myself back, which is... Uh, Pretty, pretty crazy. You look perfectly fine with a cone on your head, if you oh, ask me. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Well, yeah. well, I didn't wear that in the new music video, but uh, maybe for the next one. Those days are behind <laughs> you. So are you going to hit the road and go on tour with this new music? Yeah, we're looking at uh, April, May next year, doing an Australia, New Zealand and Singapore tour at this stage. So it's all in the... Uh, Know, the process of getting all organised at the moment. So right now, just enjoying the release um, after <laughs> two long years. So uh, yeah, it's, it's been it's been fantastic and did my launch a couple of weeks ago and, and the songs have been really well received. Nice. It's exciting at the start of a project like this, you know, putting the band, the live band together, looking at the itinerary, rehearsing, gearing yeah. up. Exciting time in your life, mate. Yeah, it is. You know, I mean, I, I, this year marks nearly 32 years for me in the industry. So. Every year I'm learning, I'm learning new experiences and I'm growing. So, you know, I've always said you just never stop learning mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, we'll never know. So I'll just get out there and do the best I can and hopefully the people love the album and the songs. Great. Well, you were born to be on stage and in the studio and yep. it's nice to see you still doing that. Congrats Great to see on you the guys new album. Too. Thank you so much, we'll guys. see you soon. And Nathan's album Hurricane and Single Strut are available now across all music streaming services.